Most games have been against hunters and warriors at the moment, which this, this deck fares fairly well against. It's good enough to keep. Most warlocks I face today are endlocks, it seems like. Looks like this might be the case again. These are potential knife juggler procs triggers. And he doesn't really want to dark bomb right now. At three mana. Oh. That's nothing he wants to do either, I think. Do I just play everything here? It's really weak against Yeah, it's super weak against Hellfire. Reporting for duty. I think I hatch a little bit. Elfire means he goes down to 17 and I still have a 1-1 one, one that I can buff with Sergeant, play Deckhand, play Guy. Well, that's, that's an easy Owl. That's a good follow-up. Or is it? 5, 6, 8, 12... 14... Yeah, but I want to protect my juggler. I also get a divine shielded minion, minion here. Also helpful. Three means he could potentially play a Molten Giant Sun Fury. So it might have been better to put him just at 14. So he could just play Molten Giant. Um, but the most likely play was this one anyways. Um, okay, I have 6 damage here. That's 5, 7, 9, 11. 11 plus 6 is 17. I need, seven, I, I need 20, okay. So that's out of the question right now. I think I just... Sacrifice the juggler and the owl. Get in there and fight, maggot. Hey, catch. It's probably better if it gets silenced. Um, yeah, very close. Molten, Molten, Argus. Oh, he actually tapped into a Molten. <laughs> oh god, seriously. Okay. I really want to go for one drops going first, but minibot is just too good to pass up, I think. Perfect. It's a lot of divine shields. Pretty good. Pew die pie. I think the famous guy we could pew pew die or something, right? I don't have a clue. Okay, it's mid range hunter, that's good. Yeah, I want to try to protect this from being hit. 
Uh, coin animal companion might... Okay. Might cause some problems. This is an annoying one. We'll just go with the blessing. Go very aggressive. You might coin Houndmaster. This just... no. This looks okay. Not a great play, but... Creeper's just too annoying to deal with. Like, I would have hit, hit, muster, hit the other spider, then I have like a 2-2 around. And a few 1-1s. Rather get some tempo here. Oh. Okay. Well, he just used an Unleash Rain. And then I play this because it's stronger than the Squire. And I think I just hope that he doesn't have a second Unleash. Then I play this and then I hope to, de to draw Divine Favor. <laughs> That's the, the strategy for now. Of course. Web spinner card, probably. <laughs> okay. Need to get rid of this. This is probably a Houndmaster setup. Uh huh. Champion, hit, hit. Wolf Rider, hit. Hit, hit. It's basically the same, but I can play the mini bot with it. And I get Light's Justice value. Oh, I don't really care, I think. Oh, yeah, well, this, this would be a reason to care, but fine. I think it's time to to screw the board control. Especially since I will get at least like two cards next turn, probably like three, which should give me a lot of more reach in the long run. If I knew he would have uh, this one again, he would have exactly unleashed in hand, I would probably have traded. But doesn't seem like he does. Oh, so that's six, eight. Ten. Nice. Four, six, ten. Berserk guts. Even more hunters. I will fight with honor. That's good. I keep it. If he doesn't play anything, t turn one. I play juggler. If he coins out like scientist or creeper, I can play the owl. Looks like a good start. See? Or nothing. 
Juggler or mini bot? It says like three health. Juggler's. Yeah, Juggler's probably a little bit better. Against stuff like Animal Companion, which is likely to come up next turn. Because I can. If it if it's Misha again, okay. Turns out Minibot was better. But if it was Misha, I could have played Minibot, hit, and then probably just trade. Uh, this was another reason to save the juggler. Well, can't have it all. I think just playing Divine Favor is too slow here. It's also off curve if I don't draw another one drop. Pretty good cards on his side. At least I have the divine favor. And now I, yeah, actually baiting out the first unleash to play the master afterwards is also quite a good thing, actually. Nightwear would be second unleash plus juggler. Then I'm probably dead. Ah. Almost. If he just has Lothab or Shredder or something, it looks quite good for me though. Okay, well that's drastic. Four cards. I think this is worth Owling. Squire over might. Because Squire can be buffed here big time. Plus the Divine Shield. It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 plus 7, 14 win. Oh, even more win. Dorgan, is there a new expansion coming out today? No, it's not coming out, it will be announced. Uh, At least we all think it's an expansion. That's a good opening. It's an even better opening. Yeah. Let's just keep this, even with Master. At what time? Um, seven hours from now. Well met. Which means I'll probably sleep then already, which means I have to look it up tomorrow. Nothing, that's really good for me. If you place nothing, I'll probably play Divine Favor next turn. Not sure. Maybe Muster. But I play the Muster into his... I might play the Muster into his Death Spite this way. Whatever. This means that I have another turn of attacking with everyone, with all the guys, if he doesn't have a whirlwind effect. If I play Shredder the next turn, I can somewhat play around Brawl, I guess. Ah, uh, well, not really. So there's the Death Spite we talked about. Still six cards. I can draw three from this and then play the Squire. Or I can play the Shredder. I can actually draw four from this and play the Squire beforehand, of course. I, 
think this is the way to go. The light protects me. Getting more reach. Getting way more reach. I fight. The battle, the battle, the battle for justice. To battle, to battle, to battle for justice. Wow, that's like all the expensive cards of the deck. That's 9, that's 13, 17, 21, 25 over 6 turns or something. Why would... Why wouldn't you do this first and then play the Belcher? This is weird. Uh, I have to play the weapon. Clears my board though. Well, every other play would have cleared my board anyways. I still have two Blessing of Might. Blessings of Might. Ah, uh, shield maiden. Ah, okay. Okay, okay. Guess we can play the fast cards here. Shredder is pretty off curve. And I have the Leroy. And another true silver. Armor. Ah, go away. Back to work. No, stop it. <laughs> Ten, twelve. Eight. Okay. It might work. I have to definitely have to do this. Especially because it's one turn before a possible Alexstrasza. So his only comebacks are like shield, second Shield Maiden, second Armorsmith right now. Probably second Belcher too. But like he might sit on an Alexstrasza for quite some time now. Like all of these cards can actually be them. Okay. Okay. Looks good for me. Yep. Retribution. Hmm. I think Master is pretty much auto keep against Paladin, especially going second. I think I don't really want to keep the Owl. If I don't have a one drop to like play against a shielded minibot, for example. I think that's a little bit better. Yeah. The light. If you place mini, but I can still can't kill it though. It's a little bit sad. Reporting for duty. If I coin master here, pretty safe against consecration. Because he cannot play it obviously the next turn. And I still have the divine shield here. And I can play these two. I can't. Keep the Divine Shield up if he has his own master. Okay. Reporting for duty. I think it's worth playing these two. Especially with two four drops coming up. It might be better to run one of these in. But I don't really care about taking one damage. 
Do you play any other games than Hearthstone? Yeah, I, I, I occasionally play Witcher at the moment. <clears throat> and I plan to play like more episodes of The Walking Dead Season 2 and the Game of Thrones game from Telltale. Well, time is scarce. I think that's better, right? Has to be better. No, I don't have a second weapon in hand, and um, Light Chest is just too good against Paladin. Yeah, that's why I wanted to play this, because I have to make this trade anyways. Probably here? Yeah. Makes sense. Keeping this out of Consecration range. Actually, why didn't I owl? Was there a reason not to owl? Whoops. I, have no time for games. I saved it for the Sylvanas. It's 9, 11, 12. Whoops. It's lethal, right? Should be 9, 11. Yep. <coughs> saved it for the Sylvanas, but it was necessary. <laughs> Well, I should have just owled it last turn, I guess. Was still pretty efficient. Uther versus Jaina. You asked for it. I will fight with honor. It's not a. Hmm. It's not a starting hand I'm looking for actively, but it doesn't look too bad either. Problem is, coining out juggler into a spell might be bad. And I should probably save it for the muster anyway, so maybe just deck hand. The problem with deck hand is. Well, there is no problem with that kind anymore. Like, I can kill a mana. I could have killed a mana worm with muster. Now I have the abusive. Nah, I, I think saving the, the juggler is too slow. I would have liked to, like, play coin turn four juggler coin protector. And then muster afterwards. Oh. Would have been nice, but too slow, I think. For justice, reporting for duty. Turn four. Uh oh. <laughs> Missiles? Ouch. Spare two of them. Face, face. Oh. Okay. This was rough. But at least I saved the coin so I can do this. And if one of them survives, I can buff it and buff it and hit things. Flame Waker mirror image would okay. Would be bad. He should have portal first. What if he gets like a what's it called? What if he would have gotten an Ironforge rifleman? And he didn't even have to ping. Um Do I care? It's like seven damage I can get in. 9, 10, 18, 13. It's not a great move. The alternative is like Wolf Rider abusive, anyways. So, yeah. I just go wild with this hand now. <laughs> I 
And maybe I draw my divine favor. Would be nice. This is turn 7. I really hope that he doesn't run Flame Strike. Or if he does that, I draw my Divine Favor. I mean, I could have run both into this, get myself frozen, have this around just without the Divine Shield and him being at more health. But then I die to Flame Strike also. Doesn't make too much of a difference. Yeah. This way, this was a lot better. Because I still have 5 7 damage on the board. He needs five attacks with in which he has four off right now. So he needs one fast card to clear my whole board. Then I need like true silver. This was one fast card basically. Yeah, I think like true silver and maybe Cockhammer, Leroy, other cards that provide lethal very soon. Oh, well, that's like almost the opposite. His hero power works against mine, so he has the board initiative. If I don't draw into good cards... He draws into good cards though. Oh, okay. Hmm, okay, fine. I take it. Oh god, I have to silence this, obviously. Nine, twelve, thirteen. Please let this don't be a taunt or heal. Nine, 